name is Glenn, and in today's video, we're going to make an aquatic ecosystem in a bottle. Please enjoy po! So for making an ecosystem, you need one goldfish or another hardy species of fish, beta or tetra, one container of fish food, one packet of aquarium rocks, one small plant, one to two cups of plant soil, one clear plastic soda bottle, medium or large, two coffee filters or tissue, nine pieces of cotton yarn or string, 14 inches in length, one large container to hold room temperature water for fish ecosystem, marker, and scissors or sharp knife. So let's go ahead on today's video. Step 1. Measure one third of the way down from the top of the clear plastic pop bottle, roughly 5 inches, and draw a line using a marker. With help from an adult, cut the soda bottle on the line so that the top can be completely removed. Once cut, clean the plastic bottle. So for step 1, you're going to cut the bottle. So as you can see, I've already cut the bottle with the help of my dad. So that is step 1 for you guys. Step 2. With help from an adult, cut a small hole in the side of the larger section, the base of the bottle. Cut the hole 1 inch down from the top. This small hole will be used to feed the fish when the ecosystem is complete. Step 2. You're going to cut a hole in the bottle. So as you can see, I've already cut a hole with the help of my mom. This is very important because this is where the food of the fish will be given at. So this is step 2 for you guys. Step 3. In the larger base of the pop bottle, add 2 cups of aquarium rocks to create a rocky floor for the fish. The aquarium rocks should create a 1 inch layer at the bottom of the pop bottle. Add the room temperature water to the pop bottle so that it fills the container less than halfway. About 2 to 3 cups of room temperature water. Place the fish in the water. So for step 3, you're going to put 2 cups of aquarium rocks inside of the bottle as I demonstrate. After you put the aquarium rocks inside of the bottle, add 2 to 3 cups of water inside of the bottle. After you put the water inside of the bottle, it's time to put the fish into the bottle. Make sure to be careful in putting the fish inside of the bottle. Step 4. Next, place two coffee filters or tissue together and cut a small hole in the middle of the filters. So for step 4, you will get two coffee filters or tissue and you will cut a small hole in the middle of it. So that is step 4 for you guys. Step 5. Cut 9 pieces of string roughly 14 inches long and tie a knot at one of the ends. Braid the strings together to create a thick wick and knot the other end so that the strings do not come apart. So for step 5, you will cut 9 pieces of string by 14 inches as I demonstrated. Step 6. Thread one end of the cotton wick through the hole in the coffee filters leaving roughly 5 inches of the string at the top and the rest dangling down. 
So for step six, you will put the thread inside of the coffee filter or tissue. Step 7. Place the coffee filter and string combination into the inverted top section of the bottle. Make sure the bottom of the braided strings hangs down from the spout of the pop bottle. Coil the other end of the braided strings so that it wraps around the base of the coffee filter. So for step 7, you will put the coffee filter or tissue and string inside of the bottle. And this is the result. So that is step 7 for you guys. Step 8. Take the plant and place it into the inverted top section with the coffee filter and string. Add extra potting soil to fill up any extra space. Make sure that the top section of the string is still coiled around the base of the coffee filter and resting near the roots of the plant. Note. This string will provide the plant with water. Eight, you will put the garden soil inside of the bottle. Step nine, and the final step, Place the plant on top of the larger section of the pop bottle that contains the water and fish so that the string hangs down into the water. Note, add water to the ecosystem if the string is not submerged. So for step 9 and the final step, you will put the first bottle into the second bottle right over here. That is how to make an aquatic ecosystem in a bottle. Hope you enjoyed the video and thank you for watching and God bless you.